Now, a lot of people like FNAF. I mean, I think FNAF's alright. I mean, I used to be a huge fan over it, but now I'm just like, eh. I don't know what you guys are thinking, but Diamond, why don't you like it anymore? Is there something wrong? No, there's something wrong with FNAF. I like it. I guess it's because I'm just getting older. I'm guessing I'm growing out of it a little. But, you know, I still liked the FNAF story, though. It's an amazing story, like... I remember me and my friends, we used to come home from, we used to be on the bus every day talking about theories, but enough about saying about that, let's get started. So, everyone heard of the game Sister Location, a new FNAF game that came out and it's in a nutshell. Well, I mean, of course it's going to be in a nutshell, it's a new FNAF game, a lot of people like FNAF, but what if I told you, you were playing as the purple guy this whole entire time, alright, 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 your brain may be, your brain may be dead for a second, I'll give you a few seconds. I'll give you five seconds. Alright. Now that you got your brain settled down, let me show you the picture. At the end of the game, the mysterious girl wants you to go into the scooping room to help all the animatronics. Now, when she means by that, well, it was obviously a trap. Well, she said that this would only hurt for a little bit. Now, after that, a lot of other things happened. She said she want. They said that she wanted to hide just like the purple guy. And what happened was, is that ap after all that blew out, pretty much we got a short clip of the night guard right here, eyes opening up, purple. Now this is really, really mysterious, and it's a really good theory. And I'm really happy that Scott Cawthon came up with this because now I have a whole new things to actually explain about but yeah there, there's theories that you could be playing as the purple guy i mean the guy's eyes are clearly freaking purple i mean you gotta think about it i mean so also what it turns out is that maybe that's why the purple guy is all purple what if he's maybe possessed by the other animatronics in sister location think about it for a little bit now after that she said this would only hurt for a little bit she wants so pretty much they want to possess him so the animatronics could hide just like him so he they want to possess him so they can hide better and stuff like that and maybe that's why the purple guy went insane and he's all purplish textured that's why he doesn't look like a normal human that's why his his uh, neck is kind of bent it down. It makes so much sense. Maybe because he's hypnotized by the other animatronics from Sister Location. That's why he looks all purpley. His neck's all bent down. He's craving for killing people. And he hides a lot in FNAF. Why does he hide a lot in FNAF? Well, it's simple to say that FNAF, the, um, the f animatronics from Sister Location wanted to hide. I don't know. I'm just... You know, clearly stating the fact that maybe this could be true. I'm not saying it, it's the truth. This is this is just a freaking theory. But yeah, it, it's so weird and so really good, you know. But anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for um so looking at my uh thing. Yeah.